Welcome. Welcome to the 21st century. <laughs> yeah, that's what we're getting into. The leading edge of time. Imagining what the future can hold. Welcome to the 21st century. New challenges, new technologies, new opportunities. Wondering what it'll mean. What it does mean is exponential innovation. Gee, exponential innovation. Yep, that's the big word, innovation. So make no small plans change for a changing world. No limits. Don't even think of limitations. Think big. Think big? Yep. Think really big, because that's where we're going. Yeah. Are you ready? Welcome to a new age of game. Are you ready? In every generation, there is a paradigm shift, a change so big that it redefines us. Mary had a little man. Mankind is always exploring, always pushing the envelope of what is possible. Tranquility Base here. The Eagle has landed. Building, refining, changing into something new. The world around us is always changing. No matter how hard some may try to stop it, change is constant. I have a dream today. Innovation leads to evolution. Evolution becomes a revolution. And man will always strive for perfection. Once in a lifetime, someone leaps over the edge and forever changes the way we think. It all began in the middle of a cornfield in Marengo, Illinois. If you can imagine this uh, farmland, that's really where it began. Uh, you know, two guys in a garage with uh, limited tools and, and limited time. And so we locked ourselves up. Uh, George drove out here every day for a few weeks. The very first thing I did was I built a proof of concept model. It's like quarter scale. As I started translating the sketches to three-dimensional foam core model, I realized this is going to work. So Pat and George threw together a prototype so that we could see what it was that they had in mind. Uh, we actually uh, built a prototype of, of what is now called Pin 2000. We called it a hollow pin. Fired it up using uh, George's old Amiga and uh, played with where we wanted the image and how we wanted to look and, and all of that. And uh, when we were done, we, we threw this thing in the back of uh, Pat's truck and drove it in. And, and uh, what we had uh, became Pinball 2000. If you could make the perfect game, where would you start? It would need to have a new technology never before seen, one that makes all previous games seem old and tired. It would have to be truly interactive, combining the physical and the virtual. Easily convertible, kittable, a modular system that could change and adapt to meet specific needs. Repair would have to be fast and easy. Software updates should be a phone call away. And it needs to have that intangible quality that will bring back players again and again. When we sat down to make this game, we made this huge list of everything that was negative uh, and everything that was positive about the product as we know it. We wanted to have a game that was reliable. We wanted to have a game that earned more money. We wanted to have a game that was more exciting. Pinball 2000, as we know it, is direct result of all of the things that were requested by operations and distribution. Pinball 2000 is the next generation pinball platform. For the first time, video has been completely and successfully integrated into the pinball experience. The video image and the play field have become one. It's like physically interacting with a movie. Imagine that you have this, this real ball, this, this real inch and a sixteenth silver steel sp sphere, and that sphere, that ball, 
comes in contact with a video object and it creates a reaction. And that video object is in, appears to be almost a hologram, a, a real thing living in this world of wood and plastic. And that stuff feels like you're right there. It's not happening away from the play field, it's happening on the play field, right in front of you. The Pinball 2000 system is completely modular. Its kittable cabinet is a marvel of engineering. Replace the easily removable play field, change the software, and in a matter of minutes, you have a brand new game. Pinball 2000 is built to change. Pinball 2000 is here to stay. Uh, we've engineered Pinball 2000 to be very durable and we think that the flexibility that is in Pinball 2000 in terms of kitting is going to give an operator tremendous flexibility in terms of how long he operates this product and how successful he is with the product. Pinball 2000 is modular in every respect and it is a system. Um, the modularity is again a request from our customers for serviceability to begin with. Um, and every piece of that system that needs to come out comes out easily and quickly. Pinball 2000's advanced technology makes maintenance quick and easy. The intuitive diagnostic screen allows you to easily troubleshoot problems. Pinball 2000 is so evolved in its design, it's simple. Pinball 2000 is the most serviceable pinball machine in the history of the game. One of the exciting new things is a feature called the location key. The operator now is able to have a key which will let him take the hand protector off and remove the playfield glass. And this allows any kind of minor repair that might keep the game working, such as a stuck ball or maybe a broken rubber band. And the system is designed so that the playfield is locked down when this key is used, so there's no access to the electronics, the bookkeeping, or most importantly, the cash box. The serviceability is just, a, it's a different world. I mean, if you carry an extra play field with you, you can bring the play field to the shop, have it cleaned, have it tweaked, make sure it's working right, take it back to location, bring the one back that needs to be serviced. If you don't want your servicemen, you know, working in, you know, under what wouldn't be the ideal conditions. But the magic, the magic of the convertibility is the play field. And the play field literally pops out of the machine and disconnects in seconds. Revenge from Mars is the first game ever for the Pinball 2000 system. The story unfolds before your eyes as your battle seamlessly travels between the real and virtual worlds within. We've had tremendous fun making, uh, ma taking the, the lore of these Martians coming to Earth and you fighting this battle to defend Earth and eventually go get to Mars. And, and take the battle back to Mars, and it's like playing a movie. It's more so like playing a movie than pinball has ever been. Pinball today, starting now, with Pinball 2000, will never be the same as it has been before. And I say that positively. It will never be the same. Whatever your preconceived notions have been for what pinball might present to the player, throw it out the window. And once again, you've got a product that once the players look inside the cabinet, uh, they're going to look inside and say, wow, those other games look old. I have to play the new game. What we've done is closed our eyes and imagined what everything we've wanted pinball to be. Um, everything that we think everyone has wanted pinball to be. And that is what Pinball 2000 is. So you can see why we say, welcome to the 21st century. Welcome to Pinball 2000. Welcome to the new image in Pinball. Welcome to the 21st century.